Hello everyone, it's Jesse here. 1-5-2016, p.m. Um, right now my dogs are pestering me. They just got through pestering me and now they're pestering me again. Uh, Stardust and Starlight want to be in my lap at the exact same time. And that just don't work out well. And right now Stardust is in my lap biting my fingers and I can't break her from biting my finger. No biting! You got to know no biting! No biting! She's just a wiggle worm. Put you down. Here. No, you don't get up here either, Starlight. Alright, um, my topic today is the Oregon Militia. This group of gentlemen that uh, have taken over a federal building. Uh, I don't know a lot about it. I don't have ta satellite television or cable TV. So I've only what read what's online and they haven't put a lot of stuff online about it. It's kind of like, where's the info? Uh, I don't know why it's not being, I don't know why it's not being taken as seriously as it should be. Um, if these guys were anything but white, I mean, yeah, if they were if they were any other type of person other than a white folk, these these Bundy, Bundy people or whoever they are, uh, this was done been taken care of. But since it's, and that's the honest truth, um, I don't know why we haven't sent some people in there and get this done peacefully without any bloodshed at least tried I mean I think like their mayor or something of the town or something like that asked them to please sir, please end this peacefully and to blah 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 and I was just like are you serious just take it to them go in there with tear gas you know if you got to and make sure nobody gets killed and take the take the federal building back take the the property back. Uh, this should have this should have happened a long time ago. Something should have been done about this already, but it's still not. The, um, unless it happened today, this evening. You know, it's 10:38 now. I haven't read anything else new about it. And so, unless they surrendered or left the property or did whatever they was going to happen, I don't think anything has happened so far. So I think they're still there. That's my assumption right now is that they're still in the in that building but I think that it needs to be it should have been taken care of long ago um, I don't know why it's not my friends are telling me that it's not on the news it's not in you know it's not a big story it's not it's they're they're saying like there's no info there's we can't get info we don't know we can't get very much information and I watched a buddy's uh, YouTube video last night I think it was last night, and uh, he was talking about it and everything, and so he knows about, he watches, he's watching the TV. Uh, he lives in Florida, by the way. But anyways, um, so he, I kind of got started with his video, and then I started reading online about what's going on. It's just a, it's a bunch of crazy shit, man. That shit shouldn't be going down in the United States at this time. It should have done been taken care of. Put it that way. Or, or something, like, there should have been advancements made already towards it. And that's my that's my end of that. Okay, um, can y'all just be any louder over there? I mean, you know, I'm not a professional vlogger per se, but uh, you guys know what I'm vlogging because I don't just sit here and talk to myself all day long. You know, they don't care. Usually, they understand me kind of and stop doing whatever they're doing, but because I talk in a loud voice but not this time they're over there scratching on something I don't know what they're doing I can't see them <laughs> but anyways um, this is my new shirt I just got it out of the back of the closet I've never worn it before I don't even know how it got into my closet I don't remember buying this shirt I don't know if my mom bought the shirt for me and put it in my closet sometime or uh, maybe it was one of my, ex <laughs> my ex's shirts I don't know uh, I just found this in the back of the closet today uh, I need to do some laundry and so I searched real good for a shirt to wear and found this in the very back like next to last shirt was this and I was like damn that's cool looking like it's like a skull with Indian I think it's cool anyways there's one more thing I want to talk about and it is this crazy it's crazy to me um, absolutely crazy well there's before I talk about that I'm gonna talk about one more thing 
like I'm an old school YouTuber. I've been around YouTube since like 2005, 2006, when it first became known. Um, and, you know, and I tapered off there for a couple of years, and then tapered back into it, and then tapered off, and then tapered, come back into it. I've been into it for now for a good four or five years or so, I'd say. And uh, I've been commenting on people. What uh, you know? This is what you fucking do, right? You you watch a YouTube video. You you sit through the ads. If you're a good subscriber, you will not have uh, ad block on your Chrome or whatever web browser you use, and you you will not have an ad block on there. You'll for YouTube. You'll use it. You'll let the ads play, so your YouTuber subscription gets their pay gets their little bit of ching. It's not like that one ad, that the one person is not going to be a big, like one view is not going to be anything. But like supporting the bigger YouTubers, I mean it, it is their full time job. So like I, I feel compelled, plus as an old school YouTuber where before there was no ad block and you just had to, you know, you had to deal with the ads anyways. Um, it's it you just get used to it so I keep my ad block off on on youtube.com I watch I sit through all the ads through all the videos I watch I watch all of my videos I watch I watch them all the way through completely from start to finish I'll sit through five ads if I have to I don't care I'm still watching my subscriptions like the video especially if they did really like it but I mean like the video anyways it's not gonna hurt to like the video and leave a comment. That's old school YouTuber. That's normal. That's that's what that's what YouTube is designed to do. It's content provided. You can like or dislike it. You can share it or not share it. And you can comment or not comment. And I get so much shit and heat in these comment sections of these YouTube video videos that I watch. The I just get my ass ringed by numerous people of course they're trolls and haters you know it's not a normal folk that's attacking me uh, somebody may disagree with what I have to say and we can have a civil conversation and I've done that before but there's 99% of them is just strictly hateful rude troll haters and I get so much shit they tell me I'm, I'm spamming one comment is spamming on a video one comment is spamming for real. I mean, if any of y'all are watching, you trolls and haters, because I know I got some. That's spamming to you? One comment on a video is spamming? Come on. Come on now. Come on. So, I'm going to continue to be the old school YouTuber that I am, and I'm going to leave a like and leave a comment like normal. And I'm not going to... it. You, I don't, I'm not affected anymore by the, the, the trolls and the haters at all. I'm not affected by them anymore. I think they're funny. Sometimes I even joke around with them back and forth because I think they're just funny as hell. It's to me now it's funny. It's, it's it's not detrimental to me anymore. It used to be a long time ago, but it isn't anymore. So you guys, you, my subscription, my subscribers out there, you don't have to worry about me about dealing with these trolls and shit. But I'm serious. Like it, it's so bad. Like I'll comment on one video on it doesn't matter who it is, and these people that also watch the video and that also comment it in the comment section leave a hate comment on my comment telling me not to comment it, it's fucking ridiculous okay done with that uh, last thing I want to do uh, my video I went I just you know I was just throughout the day I've been on on here and on there and doing whatever I haven't looked at my video section my upload section and about 10 o'clock, I looked at my video section and saw my third video down, the video I uploaded on January 4th, which was yesterday, Monday. It was called Hospitalization Required. It has 3,018 views. What the hell? And when? Uh, I was like, holy shit. Um, do we have, I, like, first of all, I question with my eyes. It's like, that's 318, not 3,018. But no, it's 3,018 views. And it, it's just astonishing me. Uh, 
you guys know I'm not somebody to sit and want to like want thousands of views and shit like that. I'm not, you know, I'm not that. I'm not like that. Uh, I'm a small YouTuber. I consider myself a small YouTuber, and to see 3,000 views on a video, legit views. They they've got to be legit views. Um, I don't think it would malfunction. This is not something that YouTube would. This is this is not happening to other people. So I legitimately got 3,000 views on that that video. Like, that's insane. That instantly put it in my top my category of top viewed videos. Like in one day, pretty much one day. One in 24 hours, it it went from no views to 3,018 views, and like, let me look at my channel. My views haven't registered on the uh, the dashboard page yet. The 3,000 views haven't registered yet. I need to put no, not as view as, not myself. My computer is so slow. It's a, I got this like four years ago. It's got Windows 7 in it. Returning subscriber. Okay. Now I'm going to go down here to my top uploads. Popular uploads. So it's not in my top four, but it's number probably number five once this loads. No, nope, not number five, number six, number seven, number eight. Wait a minute. It's not even registering it yet as under my into my popular uploads. It's not registering yet. So it's not up for, for some reason it's not registering it in my top popular uploads. But it is three thousand two eighty eight for that one. Okay, so it wouldn't be fifth, but it would be my sixth pop most popular video. My sixth most popular video. So that is insane. I don't know where that came from or how it came about, but that's awesome. It's awesome to wake up. To, well, I didn't wake up to it. I didn't find out until like 49 minutes ago because it's 1049 now. So anyways, I've talked long enough, and uh, I think that hopefully I wasn't too the Oregon militia. You know, I'm not really educated on it, but I think what I said was something everybody else is thinking. So I tried not to, to push the boundaries anywhere. All right, guys, uh, you can hear them dogs just still playing with each other. Skip it's out though. Uh, you missed it earlier. She was just totally up, like legs and arms in the air. It was funny how she was laying. She's uh, people like to watch her too. Somebody somebody commented and said, "We lo I love seeing that dog asleep in your chair." So it, she does sleep in the chair in many of my videos. All right, that's enough. Peace, guys. I love you, and I will see you on the next one.